Uh, I just most wanted to do a quick demonstration of how the vast majority of these connections go together when you're assembling Muggsy. What we have here is two pieces of open beam, aluminum extrusion, and this is what Muggsy's frame is actually made out of. And right here, we have one of these beefy 90 degree brackets, okay? These make up the vast majority of connections uh, within the, uh, the Muggsy's frame, okay? So each one of these takes four eight millimeter uh, M3 uh, hex socket um, screws. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna put the last, there's already three in there, I'm gonna put the fourth one in, and then I'm gonna show you how we connect it to the actual extrusion, okay? So bear with me for one second. Now these uh, brackets are actually 3D printed within Muggsy's prototype, but we are having them uh, injection molded. So if you buy a completed Muggsy or you buy an actual kit, uh, these will be a little easier to deal with and they'll be a much higher quality, at least edgewise. Boom, so that goes right in. Uh, apologies for any focus issues while I'm doing this. I'm using my camera phone or my phone, whatever it is. Okay, the other thing I'd like to add is each kit comes with one of these 2.5 millimeter uh, hex drivers. These are actually kind of cheap, uh, but they work really, really, really well. So you won't have to hunt down a driver. Um, and they actually sell packs of these on Amazon, and they're great. Okay. So this is the bracket with all four, four screws. Okay. And then what we're going to do is we're going to make sure that these are barely on there. Okay. Because what we have to do is, if you look there, forget that to focus, we have to slide that into the channel. Okay, so you want them to be up a little bit and then you got to line up the straight sides. Boop. Can be a little finicky when you're first doing it. It's actually a little too tight. There we go, much better. Okay, and then we'll just loosen this one up a bit and we'll slide right in any second now. Boom, perfect. Okay, so what we're gonna do then is we're gonna give this a nice tightening. A little bit goes a long way on these. These are really nice, secure connections. Okay, and then we're going to do the same thing for this other piece of extrusion. Boom, you see that went much easier. Not paying attention. There you go. And that's that. So these make up a lot of connections. You're going to be making a lot of these. I'll have the actual totals for you um, in the build manual in a couple of days. Um, and they can be a little finicky, but after you do a couple of them, you'll see where you're you know, kind of messing up and they'll start going in much easier. All right, as always, thanks for your time. And if you have any questions, just shoot a comment and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. Thank you.